Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. Uh, actually, right now it is 208. It's, I don't know, it's white. And uh, uh, it is a very nice Friday today. It was no problem from morning. And uh, we still have uh, some trades, and now it's only 2 o'clock in the afternoon. As you see here, it's 210, 6th of January. Uh, we still have one trade uh, on the NASDAQ, uh, the 4 minutes, which if you want to, you can close the trade right there, and you finish with the trade. So all, all our auto trade, all the 20 auto trades we have, uh, you have the button to direct the auto trade long short close the auto trade so this is uh, one of the best uh, chart for today and then uh, we have the ym still on one trade uh, 1200 uh, we have uh, the cl still open and it is two minutes on the last trade is 3760 uh, we have the nasdaq the last trade is 5700 and then we have the gold 2600 the gold five minutes 3600 and then we have the NASDAQ 5 minutes, 5,700 on the last trade. On the oh, ES, it is 26.62. And then on the CL, 3 minutes. This one is about to close, 2,600 on the last trade. And then uh, we have uh, 4,200 on the CL, 5 minutes. Now you can see the NASDAQ hitting 17,600 on the NASDAQ. It's right there. Wow. Welcome to trading. Uh, we have uh, the ones they closed early today. Uh, the NASDAQ two minutes. Uh, it finished around 1242 uh, today on the uh, the other channel live webinar you can see uh, the link below those videos and uh, after we were done around 11 o'clock we said there is nothing left till 12 o'clock and nothing happened till 12 o'clock and we we said after one o'clock you should start auto trading and this is exactly what happened um, the ES on the two minutes got 4,700 uh, the ES on the three minutes got 6,100 the NASDAQ three minutes got 4,900 all of them those are the early morning not the in the afternoon session they all finish around one o'clock So all those, uh, the ones that are done for the morning session, 12 o'clock finished. On the DAX, uh, two minutes, uh, 9,000. Uh, last year was uh, the DAX, two minutes and four minutes. The four minutes was my favorite. I hope we will continue on the DAX this year, two minutes or four minutes. Somehow, uh, the the two minutes and the four minutes last year on the DAX was given the best results also the the three minutes was okay but the two minutes and four minutes they were the best last year but of course after new year eve everything changed uh, on the DAX three minutes got seven thousand i don't use one minute but on the one minute got ten thousand on the DAX beautiful right on the pullback re-entry 
and then here you can see there is nothing left and it was done exactly at 12 all those charts that were done between 12 and 1 o'clock indicating those are the morning sessions the ES 8 range this one was done within an hour of uh, today and it did 6300 you can see the Nasdaq hidden above 18,000 at this moment uh, the 7 range 5800 the 9 range scalping 2300 uh, the gold 9 range uh, scalping 1100 CL10 range 1100 scalping 7 range 1000 1400 on the ES 6 range and the CL 1300 4 minutes 3100 100, and then 1400 on the NASDAQ on the 600 takes usually the 600 takes makes much more but today uh, it was done the six because the daily target is 1000 and it closed that trade within 30 minutes it started this uh, chart so we didn't have enough time to catch the trend so it was done in half an hour on the gold two minutes 3200 and it was done also you can see it was done around 1122 and Nasdaq 500 takes 2300 and look what time is finished in 30 minutes prior to the starting point and then 1950 on the YM also it was done at 1226 And then the Nasdaq, look, it was finished because of this pullback at uh, 9.30. And um, I want to also, we covered uh, two, uh, the latest auto trade we released for the zone, the FIBS. And um, on the other channel, we did go two rounds and then after the and after uh, the the session we went one more round so those auto trades this is a total different auto trade and this one here each one of them did three rounds for today and uh, let me show you We had uh, a losing trade here, and it was winning trade, 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 winning trade. This auto trade ran three times today, and then how you run it three times? Every time it hits the target, you right click, reload and restart all over again uh, the same thing on the ES uh, we can see it was a losing trade here and it was non-stop winning trades non-stop winning trade after the other winning trade after the other so this is very pleasant and uh, we are going also to cover another auto trade on Monday for our members. The Precision Auto Trade. It is an extremely um, a very good auto trade. And uh, on this auto trade, this is a total different auto trade. And uh, this one here, you can scalp it, swing trade it. And then what is special about that auto trade? It can trade with the trend in the same time you can activate the reversals with it so it can reverse and trade in with the trend in the same time 
and that it is really clever how we did this auto tray. We have a 20 auto trays, so we cannot explain everything. Uh, I mean, I need 30, 40 computers to cover 20 auto trades. Uh, on the market analyzer, we have five different automated trade, ATM, ATM strategy, um, full automated. There is five different automated trade on it. And all of it based on the signal you see on the market analyzer. On the ES, uh, this market analyzer is based on one contract only. On the last entry, if we look at the chart on the last entry signal, here is the entry and here is the target. It just hit the target and now it's going to flash uh, target hit. On the last entry based on one contract, we have 66 stakes. Based on the last entry NASDAQ, one contract, not four, not two, one contract. Only the last entry, not the whole day. On the NASDAQ, we can see the entry for the auto trade signal, and it is 945 takes, 47 takes based on one contract only. On the YM, 82 takes based on the last entry only, not the whole day. You don't need to trade all of it. If you have enough money for the EIS, NASDAQ, Dow Jones, if you have one contract EIS, one contract NASDAQ, one contract YM, you don't need the rest. It is 875 plus 4800 plus 415. Then if you have more money, you can add the CL. The CL just fired a signal here, as you see. The CL fired a signal, and now it start rolling the CL if you wanted to add CL. This way, you're not committed to one uh, instrument. So what you are doing, you're hedging the future market. So if, God forbid, the NASDAQ is not doing well, the ES is doing well. If the YM not doing well, the CL is doing well. So in this way, you have four horses, ES, NASDAQ, Dow Jones, CL, running. If one of them die, the other one keep running. So you don't look anymore on the CL trade or a NASDAQ trade or an ES trade. Once you accomplish your total amount of takes. You can shut down everything. You can uh, add CL, you can add 30 year treasury bond, you can add any instrument nature trader can provide, can uh, calculate the signal for you. As we see here right now, we have the NASDAQ, when we were talking, it was like what, around 17,000 Within minutes, now we are climbing to the 20,000. And uh, I mean, welcome to trade and nothing can be done. When the market is trending, make you love the trade. And um, so on the market analyzer, based on the last entry signal only, we have 1,478 ticks based on one contract. And now we are about to hit uh, 20,000 uh, on the NASDAQ. And uh, there is uh, also uh, two hours to the market to close. Uh, folks, that's all what we have for you. We wish you a very pleasant and a successful year this year. And take my advice, learn. When you want to get an auto trade, make sure you get support and training, not to just optimization, training how to look at the market, training how you can observe the market, how many updates you get on that auto trade. Most, most of the years we have been updating between 20 to 30 times a year 
to keep up with the market. It's not to just buy in and auto trade and then you are okay. The auto trade require maintenance, require updates constantly to keep up with the market. Practically every week we have a new update. Practically every week. Plus we train people how to look at the market and then you start observing what's going on in the market then life will be much easier on you and you can recognize when there is a problem in the market you need to stay away. So today on the other channel we have explained how Friday you need to approach Friday. So you can see the link below and go back. We have total explanation on a Friday how you can approach Friday. Monday is different. Tuesday is different. Wednesday is different. You cannot get one screwdriver and it's going to work for you to all engines and take apart all engine because you have one set of tools. In 2023, you have to have the proper training, education, different type of tools to approach the market from swing trading, reversal, scalping. There is, there is so much you need to learn and you need to have different tools to approach the 2023. You cannot come with a little stick and you think you're going to beat up the market with it. You're going to be left behind. In 2023, the algorithm also got much farther than last year. So when you are auto trading and somebody else is using smarter auto trade, you have no chance to win. If the other person have more knowledge than you, you have no chance to win. So please, folks, do your homework before you start turning on your life account. This is the best advice for you for 2023. Thank you very much and God bless you all and wish you a pleasant weekend. Bye for now.